The world's most famous female aviator, Amelia Earhart, was born in this house in Atchison in 1897. While trying to become the first woman to fly around the world, she was killed when she ran out of gas and her plane went down in the Pacific. One of the many tributes to Amelia is called Amelia Comes Home. It's located south of town along Kansas Highway 7. first choice because it was we talked about you know being a little ways out of town so that people were still seeing the countryside and would have an aha moment when they saw it um, before I introduce John I just want a heartfelt thanks first of all to Corky and Gloria Jackson who own the property and then another huge thank you to their daughter Michelle and Ron Urban and Urban Lawn Care because they have been exactly what John needed since he got here. One of the Amelia busts, and we put on it in appreciation. John Cerny, Amelia Comes Home, Amelia Earhart Festival, July 18th, wow. 2012. And I have to say, this is the only man who owns <laughs> one of these. That is true. <laughs> Woo! I'm John Cerny. I'm a mural artist from Salinas, California. I've uh, been an artist for the last 25, 27 years, but I've been doing these plywood structures since the early 90s, so almost going on 18, 19 years of these these odd highway plywood murals. And I wanted to do my version of what happened to Amelia. Uh, she's still alive, and she made it home to her hometown of Atchison, Kansas. Uh, ran out of gas, she's holding the map, and she just, at this point, the face, her facial expression is saying, I did this, I made it home, I'm fine, I don't need to go any, go any further. I love the idea that I'll hear a story later that, oh, you're, you're the guy who did that, but boy, my grandkids, we used to drive from Leavenworth up to whatever, or go through to Kansas City, and we'd stop on Highway 73, and we'd pull over, we'd take a picture and see how Amelia's doing. Those kind of stories, just I just love that kind of thing, where it maybe it became part of the kids' childhood. I, won't, I may not be in Kansas for years, but she's going to be with me on my desk from now on. <laughs> 